Welcome to Learn Commerce PU Online Classes. forget to like our video and subscribe our YouTube channel for all the updates. Welcome to our second PU Computer Science online classes. In last class, we know some of example for our Boolean expression. We know that depend on the variables, we are going to create the table, three variables, then 4041, then next is column 2021 and third column 0101. And maybe two variables are there, then the column value we are going to take as 2021 0, 0, 1, 0, 1. Now let's like that only the next last example for our Boolean expression. So solve the expression A plus complement B plus C plus complement C by using the whole expressions. Okay using the truth table. So first of all we know that we are going to count know how many variables are there in our question. So totally in this question three variables are the variables name A, B, C. So we know that how many values we need to take and which table we need to use to solve this truth table. So we using the column values name are the a, B, C and values 4, 0, 4, 1. B, val B column value 2, 0, 2, 1, 2, 0, 2, 1. C column value 0, 1, 0, 1, 0, 1 and 0, 1. We know that first of all we need to take which value. Maybe if any parenthesis, if any expression that is in any parenthesis, such expression should be calculated first. So this is the first note of the precedence rule. So first of all in parenthesis the values are complement B and C. We no need to make the calculation for the column C. We already know what is the value of the C. We already calculated. We already know the value. We added the value for the column C. So first I am taking complement B. We know the value for column B. Now the same value only going to make the complementation. We know the meaning of the complementation, 0 changing to 1, 1 value change to the 0. So B, 0 is that. So just I am using value for complement B, 1, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1 is that, 2, 0, 0. We need to make the changes as 1, 0 to the 1, 1 the value to 0 and 1 the value is the 0 and I already said the C column value we already calculated we know the value of the C. Now second thing I am going to select that is first of all we need to calculate the expression value if there is any value is that in parenthesis such value is calculated first. So I am selecting the next complement C, complement C. So the third column value the column name is the C, such one going to change to the complement C. So 0, 1, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 0 is that. So we need to change to the 1, 1, 0, 0 value is that. So changing to 1, 1 value need to change to the 0. So now just we completed the whole expression that means the whole parenthesis value in the expression. And after that, just only in our expression is that, so I am taking the value complement B. First of all, I saw by using separately the each column value. Now I am going to join the values but because I know the value for A or maybe value for B and C. And also for the complement value for B as well as the C value we already know before that only and the complement C. Now just such complement B plus C value I am going to add. So we need to take column number 4 and 3. Clear this one? 
complement B plus C, the column number 4 and the column number 3 and such value we need to make the addition plus sign is the logical addition or symbol. So, 0 plus 1 value it is a 1, 1 plus 1 always value it is a 1 and later next one 0 plus 0 value it is a 0, 1 plus 0 the value it is a 1, 0 plus 1 value it is a 1, 1 plus 1 the value when you are going to add value it is a 1, 0 plus 0 the value 0, 1 plus 0 the value it is a 1. Now we got such value. Now after getting the value complement B plus C such value we need to make the addition add with the column complement C. So, this column we are going to add that means 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Fifth and the sixth column we are going to make the addition. Fifth and sixth column. In fifth column complement C and in our next column complement B plus C I am going to add. So, when you are adding the by taking using these two column values 1 plus 1 1 0 plus 1 1 1 plus 0 1 0 plus 1 1 1 plus 1 the value 1 0 plus 1 1 1 plus 0 1 0 plus 1 1 clear this part and later now we completed whatever is there in the parenthesis every value we know about this one what's the value or the value we need to add to the column correct and later after getting such value later what such value going to make the addition with the variable a so we need to add which value we need to take the first column value the first column name a and such value going to add with the column our last but one okay so the column complement b plus c plus complement c so when you are going to add 0 plus 1 1 0 plus 1 1 0 plus 1 the value 1 0 plus 1 the value 1 1 plus 1 the value 1 later 1 plus 1 the value 1 here and later 1 plus 1 always the value 1 and later 1 plus and to this column the always the value is a 1. So, clear this part. So, like that we are going to calculate uh, the value of the boolean expressions. So, A, B, C, complement B, complement C, complement B plus C and complement B plus C plus complement C and finally, we will get the answer for the whole expression, boolean expression that is A plus complement B plus C we completed by using parentheses okay plus complement C. So, this is about the one simple solution for the question, the question we know that about and after completing now let us some important other concept in our boolean algebra the first question what is logic gates. So, what about the logic gate? A logic gate it is a gate or we can say as an electronic circuit ok and that operates by using one or more input signal why well, because we know that in logic gate three gates are there not gate one input one output or gate maybe two or more than two inputs only one output and gate maybe like our or gate two or more input only one output so that operates or which operates the logic gate operates using one or more input signal and always produce only one output signal so this is the definition about the logic gate okay so we can use maybe it's a not gate one input one output but maybe it's a or gate and gate we can use we need to use two or more input and later it producing always it going to produce only one output. So, it is an electronic circuit which operates on one or more input signal and always producing only one output signal and in logic gate there are three types are there not gate or gate and gate ok. So, not gate 
is also called as the inverter i n v e r t e r inverter not gate is called as the inverter now let's some explanation about our not gate not gate we know that other name call as the inverter it is also a gate or not gate is an electronic circuit which operates on only one input signal and one output signal okay so in our truth table x complement x so when you are using value 0 it going to reverse the complementation opposite of the values giving providing opposite of the values so 0 the output value as 1 input 1 then output is the 0 and later maybe the second truth table just we know that the 0 value that is equal to false or low value and 1 it is a true and high value ok so these are or this one is called as the truth table of the not gate and this diagram or the symbol shows the not gate so this is the symbol of the not gate x complement x so x not okay the x not so this is called as the symbol of the not gate so finally we can say about the not gate the output is always opposite or the output state or signal is always complement or the opposite of the input gate when output 1 input 0 when output 0 input 1 so the output state or signal is always opposite or complement of the input gate so this is some explanation about the not gate we know that the meaning of the logic gate the logic gate is also called as electronic circuit and which operates on one or more input signal sometime maybe not gate just it have one input one output or gate has two or more than two inputs but only one output and and gate like our or gate only it also have two or more inputs and just producing only one output now which operates the logic gate definition which operates on one or more input signal and produces only one output signal the types of the logic gates or there are three types are that the types are not gate the not gate also call as the inverter i n v e r t e r inverter or gate and third gate name is called as the and gate a n d now let's first of all about our not gate and this symbol about our not gate we know that in not gate that operates or this operation using only one variables so first one is called as the input so x complement x or we can say as the x bar if you are using the value inputting the value 0 then output value is the 1 if input value is 1 the output value is the 0 so this is the truth table of our not gate and this is called as the symbol of the not gate and we know that in our second truth table here just in first truth, ta uh, truth table the value 0 is that but in our second truth table we know that the 0 value is equal to false the false value only call as the low ok the low value and later the 1 that is equal to true the true value is equal to high and later 1 so the in truth value I used the value high and later the value complement x the value 0 is that so that is equal to the low value and we know the meaning of the not gate not gate is also called as the inverter gate and which act or that accept only one input signal and producing only one output signal 
and the output state or signal is always opposite of the input state correct no kya when the input is 0 output is 1 when the output is 0 then input is the 1 ok so we can say an inverter or not gate is a gate with only one input signal and one output signal and the output state is always complement or opposite of the input state so clear so this is the explanation about the not gate now let's our second gate the next gate name or gate and we know that the or gate has two or more input signals in our first table two input signals are there in our second table three input signals are there so you know, it has two or more input signal but only one output signal and how we getting the output of the NOR gate so we can say the output will be the logical addition of the input the output will be the logical addition of the input so logical addition symbol is the plus ok now two input this table shows two inputs and this table shows three inputs but only one output so I used the column name as the result ok so you can use maybe instead of R you can use X plus Y and maybe in three table output instead of R you can use the X plus Y plus Z otherwise just only you can write by using the uh, letter R ok the R is equal to the result in our two variables are there we already know if two variables are there 2 to the power of 2 that is equal to 4 variables so the 4 variables values 2 0 2 1 and second column value 0 1 0 1 now I want to get the result so how I am going to get the result of the or get we know that maybe any result if you want we need to make the addition by using two input values so when you are going to add 0 plus 0 the value is the 0 0 plus 1 value is 1 1 plus 0 value is 1 1 plus 1 always remember it 1 plus 1 don't say it is a 2 it is a boolean algebra values here so 1 plus 1 always we need to write the value as the 1 only clear this point here so this is the result and some truth table of the or gate now let's our next sec, uh, ne next table by using three input or gate so i am using the x y z as the input value and later after writing after entering some value for x y z later i uh, am going to check the value for the result so our x value 2 to the power of 3 that is equal to 8 rows ok 2 to the power of 3 3 variables are there variables are x y z so 2 to the power of 3 the uh, number of the combination in the total that is equal to 8 rows now in first column 4 0 I am going to enter and later next one 1 4 1s are there we know that totally 8 rows means it going to start from the value 0 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 I started from the value 0 so just till the value 7 ok we need to enter the value in each cell in each row so 4 zeros 4 1 in second column 2 0 2 1 2 0 2 1 in third column 0 1 0 1 0 1 and 0 1 now after completing using the value in each logical variable or the statement now I am going to uh, get the result for the values the R result value otherwise we 
can use x plus y plus z okay the x plus y plus z otherwise that is called as the r that is equal to the result now uh, how to get the value for the result now whatever the variables are there in each column such one going to add so i am using 0 plus 0 plus 0 that means the value will get as the 0 okay and later now i am going to take the second row value so 0 plus 0 always the value is 0 now 0 plus 1 when you are going to add 0 plus 1 the value will get as the 1 and next thing about our 0 plus 1 value is 1 1 plus 0 the value is a 1 okay and later next one 0 plus 1 that means the value still here we got the value as the 1 and after getting the value 1 then again such 1 going to add with the value 1. So when you are using 1 plus 1 what is the value you are going to write the value is 1 only clear this point here 1 plus 1 the value is a 1 only in our boolean algebra values and later next one is the next one i am going to add the value of the x y z we know the value of the x column 1 y column 0 z column 0 when you are adding 1 plus 0 the value is a 1 and later next one again our next value we need to add that is the 0 so we'll get the answer as the 1 okay and later next one is about our next column the value is a 1 1 plus 1 the value is always 1 only and next one the 1 plus 1 the value is a 1 plus 0 so value will get as the 1 only and later next one lastly 1 plus 1 plus 1 3 values are that so don't tell it's a 3 clear this point here 1 plus 1 plus 1 it is not equal to 3 in our boolean algebra values here so 1 plus 1 plus 1 that is equal to the 11 so we just we are going to take the value as the 1 only clear this point here so actually the value may be the uh, 1 plus 1 the value is equal to 10 clear this point 1 plus 1 the value is equal to 10 and when you are adding 1 plus 1 plus 1 that is equal to the 11 so while we are not going to enter the 10 or the 11 just only the one digit we are going to take so always remember it 1 plus 1 plus 1 that is equal to 1 only so like that we are getting the value of the truth table of our or gate clear this one so or gate we can say that it is a gate and it has two or more input signals but always producing only one output signal and what about our output so here we can say that the output will be the logical addition of the input always will get by using the plus sign okay we need to add the value to get the result of the or gate and later next one this is the symbol and this symbol is or this symbol shows the diagram of the or gate so just only for two variables we can say as the x or y that is equal to result otherwise how we are using x plus y clear x plus y otherwise we can use simply that is the r here and later the second symbol also shows why well, because this symbol just only shows two variable or gate and this symbol shows the three variables or gate so variables are x or y or z that is equal to the result x plus y plus z maybe four variables are there then we need to draw four lines okay so x y z and the w otherwise you can use the variable name as the a b c d any variable name and later next one is the and this is called as the symbol of the four variables or gate clear this point so and finally we need to write as the result how we are going to read x or y or z or w that is equal to the result x plus y plus z plus w okay so this is called about our or gate and later after completing the or gate now let's the next gate that is called as the and gate uh, because here three uh, types are that 
not get second one is the or get and third gate name is called as the and gate so what about the and gate and how we getting the output of the and gate so and gate has two or more input signal maybe we can create the truth table by using two variable or also possible to create truth table by using three variables so it has two or more uh, two two or more two or more input signals but only one output signals okay kya maybe two input signals are there but output is only the one and maybe three input signals are there but it producing the output only one and what about the output how will get the output of the and gate so the output will be the logical multiplication of the input so the output is the logical multiplication so multiplication that the symbol using or the symbol of the and gate that is called as the dot the dot means it is called as the multiplication we will get just by multiplying the value of each columns okay and later next one may be two input or uh, two input and gate so uh, two variables are that the first variable name is the x second variable name is the y and the third uh, that is called as the third column name is the result so two variables are there we need to use the value for two variable 2021 okay so the 2021 and the second column value 0101 now just how we getting the uh, result of the and get we need to make the multiplication by using two column values so 0 into 0 the value result value is the 0 0 into 1 so when you are going to multiply with the 0 with the value 1 so the value is the 0 1 into 0 the value is always 0 and finally 1 into 1 the value is the 1 only so like that we'll get the answer so we can say that output of the and gate will be the logical multiplication of the input now about the three variables our and gate so three variables and gate we need to use three variables name three logical statement name the names i am i am using the uh, the names are x y z okay the x y z that means how many rows how many total number of rows we need to prepare the three variable truth table so the 2 to the power of 3 that is equal to 8 so how we got the value 8 2 into 2 into 2 so 2 to the 4 4 into 2 that is equal to the 8 rows we need so now our x value 40 and 41 the y value 20 21 20 21 and later z value 0 1 0 1 0 and lastly also 0 1 clear this point here so this is about the uh, three column values now lastly for our result i want to get the result of the and gate so we already know the output will be the logical multiplication of the input so 0 into 0 the value 0 into 0 so we'll get the value as the 0 next one is the we need to multiply 0 into 0 0 0 into 1 always value it's a 0 again 0 into 1 the value is 0 0 into 0 the value is the 0 and later 0 into 1 the value is a 0 and later 0 into 1 always the value is the 0 only and later 1 into 0 the value is 0 and later 0 into 0 the value it's a 0 after next thing 1 into 0 when you are going to multiply the value is 0 0 into 1 the value is the 0 okay and later 1 into 1 now the value it's a 1 now just we got the result 1 but when you are going to multiply with 0 the value is a 0 only and finally what's the value will get as the input 1 into 1 the value is 1 and again when you 
are going to multiply with the last one the value is it is not 1 into 1 into 1 it is 1 into 1 that is the 1 into 1 that is the value is called as the 1 only ok so the result will get as the everywhere there is the value 0 but lastly just only will get the value as the 1 and later how uh, we know some of the symbols are there for the not get x not that is called as the x bar complement of the x and this is the symbol for our or get x or y that is equal to the result or maybe three variables four variables or get and later finally the symbol for our and get so how we are going to read the symbol and get x and x and y the result that is called as the x and y okay and later next one is the the three variables and get x and y and z that is equal to the result otherwise you can write x into y into z clear this part here and maybe if you want four variables or get that means we need four columns the four columns and later we need to draw the and get maybe if you are going to take the variable name a b c d and this is called as the result and how we are going to read a and b and c and d the result so a dot b dot c dot d clear this point so this is some of the explanation about all gate the gates are not gate not gate is also called as the inverter or gate as well as the last name is called as the and gate thank you don't forget to like our video and subscribe our youtube channel for all the updates